Do you know what this is? Right, it's an apple. Yeah. <laughs> now all of us, you know, we know how to talk about an apple. The problem is what do we do when we want to make a digital version of this? In 2020, Cardano Foundation partnered with Bioswine to showcase the blockchain technology for track and trace solutions. Together with the Scan Trust, this technology is allowing and is revolutionizing the way the wine is sold by allowing the customer to have more direct interaction with the winemaker and uh, to have the traceability of the winery itself. Through this project, Bias Wine opened up four new international markets and had a sales increase by 35%. In 2022, and as a direct result of the project with Bias Wine, the Georgian government through the Georgian National Wine Agency pursued a pilot project uh, for implementing the Cardano technology by allocating the entire Bolnisi Appalachian, where the oldest winemaking artifacts were discovered. The Cardano Foundation visited in September 2022 to learn more about the Georgian winemaking, to educate about the blockchain and to sign the agreement with the Georgian government. The journey started with Bias Wine about two years ago, but the same journey started within the Cardano Foundation. We started um, defining our strategy, and part of that was, you know, enterprise adoption, real world adoption, okay? We wanted to connect with people. We wanted to make a change outside of the blockchain space. <laughs> Bonishari <laughs> Cardanos <laughs> Qual <laughs> Is <laughs> 
ექვსი ოქროს მედალი მიიღო ქვევრმა კლასიკური დაყენებულმა საფერავმა და ხაწითელმა. ჩვენთვის რა არის ყველაზე კაი და საჭირო ის არის რომ მე ჩემი მიღვინო მიმწოდებელთან მივიდეს ისე როგორც ჩამოვასხა QR კოდებს კეთდება რომელიც მიხედვითაც ნებისმიერი პიროვნება შევა და წარმოშობას უყველაფერს შეხედავს და ამ გვინის გაყალბება დაცული იქნება რა. So we are here standing on top of Mount Elia in Bonisi, Georgia, which is often known as the birthplace of wine, and it's home to the oldest known artifacts within the global wine industry. Behind me is St. Peter and Paul Monastery, which is actually one of the participating organizations from the Bonisi Winemakers Association to join us on a digital transformation strategy. Uh, you know, here they have their own winery following you know very traditional and you know, ancient winemaking processes known to the region დღეს ვაწერ თხელს მემორანდუმ სადაც ძველადიან პერსპექტივაში ვაპირებ თანამშრომლობას კარდანოსთან ქართული ღვინის გაციფრულების ასე ვთქვათ კუთხით მათ შორის ყველაზე მთავარი და ყველაზე პირველი ეს შეეხება ჩვენ დაცულ ადგილ წარმოშობის დასახელებებს ჩვენ ყველაზე საამაყო და საუკეთესო ღვინოებს ბლოკჩეინზე განთავსდება მთელი სერტიფიცირების პროცედურები, რაც უზრუნველყოფს პროდუქციის ეტიკეტთან შესაბამისობას და საუკეთესო ხარისხს. We are here today at the Naparayuli village at the Shumi Bio Vineyard during the harvest period for what is known in Georgia as one of the highest quality wines due to its preferable growing conditions and rich minerals within the soil. Now the reason why we're here is to understand digital transformation processes not to change how the wine is made but the business of its wine itself in order to tell this story at the global stage. The reason we're here is to see how we can connect blockchain with this part of the world. If we can do it here, I think we can do it anywhere. Me gwino ba shumi ors gamoichoda magal kharisxovani gwinit, razits metqvelebs aramartois migi uamravi aghiareba rats mas migebuli aks suplo svasva pressur konkursebze aramed imitats rom chven qovolsvis dilobdit chveni qurzeni romelits shemodis tsarmoebashi qopili qo qovolobkhrivi datsuli kharisxobrivat unaklo evropuli da sartashoriso standartebis datsvit ყოველთვის ცდილობთ რომ მიკოლევადობა იყოს ადვილი რომელი ვენახიდან რომელ დროს სად არის დაკრეფილი და შეგვეძლოს თითოეული ბოთლის შემთხვევაში მიუყვეთ ვენახის და ამ ყუთის წარმოშობის ადგილს. By the way Georgia is one of the uh, first post Soviet countries to have separate law on wine and wine. There is presidential decree uh, on the protection of Uh, designations of origins and geographical indications. There is also an order of Ministry of Agriculture uh, on state control of uh, protected designations of origin wines. And there is um, also order on certification of wines, of course including uh, GIs. We have this temporary base, temporary headquarters here. Uh, it's harvest monitoring uh, headquarters and you can see when that we are really monitoring everything like fortune what's special about this project is that we are setting the design for a a way that an industry can be augmented with blockchain technology and not just within one specific region but across an entire nation and maybe beyond maybe right. beyond yeah I mean this was our first project that you know, we were we were doing together in the foundation and at that time we were looking at building out applications that would maintain the brand quality of Cardano and you know part of Cardano's value is serving as critical infrastructure that you can rely on the major issue had been for anything to do with supply chain tracking is that the way that a blockchain was being used at the time yeah. was just having a data hash and this was referred to as garbage in garbage out you don't know what is being added to a blockchain you have no ability to to audit that information and that was the exact limitation that we were looking to solve with the national wine agency we are piloting out 
this digital transformation strategy to where we are able to integrate the, the wine certification data and the supply chain data by each winery into these public accessible records that gets connected to every bottle of wine sold out of yep. the Bonisi region.